let us see the wind power generation wind power plant previously we studied about hydel nuclear and solar power now we go for wind power generation wind power generation system or wind power plant is a renewable energy source because wind is abund abundant of wind is available at hilly areas most of the power plants are at hilly areas only this wind power plants wind power plant is used for generation of electrical energy from wind turbine the wind power plant is also known as wind farm or wind turbine the wind farm plant is renewable energy source of electrical energy the wind turbine is designed to use speed of the turbine speed of the turbine the wind speed is designed to use the speed and power of the wind convert into electrical energy that is wind power plant now the wind turbine can operating between wind speed 40 km per hour to 90 km per hour this is the wind speed required let us see the block diagram and how wind power plant works what are the various components in wind power plant normally in this are uh, wind power plants are used to reduce the power deficit in a network or grid power deficit most of the base plants these are the electric power generated from the wind power plant varies with variation widely because wind velocity may changes according to the direction of the wind the wind velocity may be changes hence the power generation may also varies hence these are used to reduce the power deficit only a wind turbine is a device which converts kinetic energy of wind into electrical power let us see the block diagram wind turbines are mainly classified into two types this is the block diagram of wind power generation the block diagram consists of mainly the wind the main components of wind turbine is the wind will fall in on the blades rotor blades low speed shaft and gear system coupling will be there gear system coupling gear box it is called gear box the rotor consists of hub blades and pitch and regulating system whereas blades these are the blades the blades are made of air foil design which depends on aerodynamic lift to move the blades and another one is shaft a shaft is connected to a gear box the rotor which is rotating up to 30 to 60 rpm normally wind power plant the blades will not rotate very fastly they will slowly rotate but gear system produces more speed gear box is connected in between low speed shaft and high speed shaft between generator and wind wind power plant blades the gear box is connected in between low speed shaft and high speed shaft to increase the rotational speed from 30 to 60 kilometers per hour kmph high speed shaft tower is made up of steel it is the tower which is made up of steel this is the another part of wind power plant tower is made up of steel to convert support to produce support for this blades structure of the turbine working of wind power plant in you can see when the wind strikes the rotor blades the rotor blade starts rotating and the turbine rotor is connected to a high speed gear box high speed will be produced because generator requires to 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 generate some frequency it has should be run at constant speed whatever the speed according to gear system and coupling the speed will be maintained constant in generator that produces the electrical voltage the gear box transforms the rotational energy low speed to high speed the gear box transforms the rotational energy which is get from wind turbine is slow speed but it produces more speed the speed of the shaft from gear box is coupled with rotor of the generator and hence electrical alternator or ac generator generates electricity and this generated voltage is controlled controller will be there it will be stored in battery or directly connected to power grid controller it is a charge controller similar to solar power panel charge controller will be there what are the advantages of wind power plant 
these are the various types of blade two blade three blades of wind power plant turbine wind turbine boards blades these are normally the configuration is for wide range of power generation 15 kilowatt to 3 megawatt blade turbines are used 12 to 20 blades also in multi blade system 12 to 24 20 also because a high speed wind if it is available in some areas those areas we can use high speed site selection for a wind power plant how to select the site based on wind speed grid structure distance altitude of location nature of ground land cost all these are plays important role to select the site wind speed it should be wind speed all small change in the wind speed where is more generated power hence where normal wind and high wind velocity if the wind velocity increases it will be changed after the data grid structure distance or altitude location nature of load land cost all this will be considered for wind power plant now what are the advantages of wind power plant is capital cost of wind power plant is high because of 3.5 crores one wind from one wind power plant if you want to construct uh, approximately 3.5 crores will be happen disadvantage that is large variations in wind speed during the storms may cause damage and windmill large variations in wind speed may cause damage the windmill also the efficiency of the system in the range of 35 to 45 only percent is the efficiency next advantages are there it is free and inexhaustible source wind is and no pollution clean energy and green energy will be there no polluting source of energy it has low maintenance cost because uh, it requires only maintenance the gearbox on generator or correctly or not schedule maintenance schedule is required less maintenance compared to nuclear power plant or thermal power plant that is about wind power generation